Welcome back, everyone. Ooh, Halloween decorations are not the only creepy things you'll see in some Utah neighborhoods. During the fall, male tarantulas, they leave their burrows to find a female mate, sometimes wandering into neighborhoods in their quest for love. Fox 13 News reporter Darian DeBruel shows us how local neighborhoods are now reacting to the increase in tarantula sightings. We have a lot of, a uh, lot of rattlesnakes and gopher snakes and yellow belly racers and, and then to my surprise, tarantulas. It's that time of year when Lake Point's resident tarantula relocators, Lillian Erickson and her daughter Lois, are getting more calls from neighbors. In August, we start getting, you know, three or four calls a week for, for tarantulas. They'll just like text my mom if they have her personal number or message her on Facebook, or they'll just make a post on Facebook and tag her in it. At just 14 years old, Lois has become enamored with the eight-legged creatures, learning everything about them to help out scared neighbors and keep the spider safe. We go over there, we see where it is, and then for me, I get my gloves on, and then I just carefully sort of sweep it onto my hand, and then I'll hold it for a minute if I want to, or if he seems like he might be more stressed or, agitated, then I might just put him in the bin to try to stop from causing him further stress. We relocated one the other day and she's like, just pick it up, mom. So I picked it up in my hand and I was just in the midst of saying, OK, that's not too bad when it literally jumped from here to here. It said a lot of words that I can't see on camera. Tarantulas aren't only being spotted in Twilla. They're also hanging out in some St. George neighborhoods. We're kind of in the uh, latter end of the tarantula mating season. As we build more and more into their natural habitat, into their homes, we we just kind of see them when they when they do choose to come out. Dylan Thomas, like Lois, is not one to leave the spiders at risk. When he sees them in the road, he picks them up and takes them to a safer route. One of my favorite things about October and Halloween is seeing the tarantulas crossing the roads. If you're anything like me or Lily, if you see a tarantula, you might want to scream and then run away. But Lois and Dylan tell me they're actually dogs docile creatures. They're extremely docile, gentle uh, animals, uh, and they serve a tremendously good role in the ecosystem as uh, both predators and prey. It's natural to be afraid of things that are unfamiliar to you, and especially when so much of like different movies, TV shows, whatever, sort of make them seem evil. They aren't demons. They aren't trying to come for you all the time. They're just there. In Tooele, Darian DeBrule, Fox 13 News, Utah.